Here in Winnetka on a secluded parcel, I've come to a house that began in 1907. This part behind me with the Tudor details and great arts and crafts touches was built then. And then in 2005, this addition was made. There had been some other additions prior, but the owners came in and really reworked the house. They extended the arts and crafts details and created a, actually a completely new house with that old one as its core. Susan Myers, the agent on the house, is going to talk with me a little bit about what exactly they did. They, it seems as if it's an all new house, but with its history intact. Yes, they doubled the size of the house, uh, creating a, a new arts and crafts home inspired by Charles Boise, who is an English architect. And in doing that, they brought in everything they needed for living today, but keeping the beautiful historical details. Well, and the details start right outside where we've got these great lanterns, and then we go inside mm -hmm. through a beautiful wood foyer and a great staircase we'll get to later to a family room that has, like these lamps, has the beautiful tile surround. Feels yes. as if it might have been here in 1907, but brand new yes. or a few years old. And then the family room is gorgeous. It it's, opens out onto a balcony. That's right. It's a nice big room. It's a large room, but it feels very warm and inviting. And they, they reproduce the uh, fireplace surround that was seen in an upper a fireplace on the second floor. And it had beautiful uh, arts and crafts tile that just sets the tone for the space. Nice big space, a big family room, which we wouldn't have had in a Tudor That's in right. 1907. That's right. And next to it, a more formal living room. And uh -huh. I think that, is that the original living that room? That is the original living room, yes. And then we see more of those arts and crafts details in the kitchen. Very large kitchen. We know that that's the reason they made the addition, because when they moved here, there was a very small old servant's kitchen. So they created something that feels brand new, feels today, but looks as if it was made in 1907 with the arts and crafts cabinetry, the stenciling. That's right, and all the cabinetry hides today's appliances, so when you walk into the room, it, it has a sense of uh, not installed, but fitted pieces of furniture and a huge island that is great for cooking. It really accommodates a large family. That's terrific. And then that large family can spill over into this dining room, mm -hmm. um, which they created again because mm -hmm. they didn't have enough space in the, in the original, right? That's right. At, but it feels like an old room. It's got the beams in the ceiling. Beam ceiling, uh, south-facing windows that uh, let in so much light. Uh, and also, one of the things they did, another large room that they felt needed to have a more intimate feel, so the beams are actually inset into the ceiling so as not to create too much mass. Then beyond the dining room, on the other side of the dining room, is another sort of trick they played, mm -hmm. right? They tried to create some history, a, yeah. a room that didn't exist before, a brand new porch, but they used the stucco from the exterior to make it look like it had been an exterior wall, which is nice, so that we really feel as if the house has been here since 07, but we mean 1907. Actually, it didn't come until 2005. 2000, yes, and That's I think great. that they did a fabulous job. It's um, nicely integrated. Yes, it's, it's just, it's seamless and it feels like it was always here. And we should talk a little bit about the color scheme. Each floor of the house, there are four if you count the basement, is a different season. So the first floor is autumn. That's right, in spite with rust tones and uh, the second floor is based on a spring motif. There are two rugs on the second floor in the old and new master that are copies of Charles Boise's original design. One of them is called Spring, that was the inspiration. And one of them is in the, the old master, which is terrific. A, yes. a beautiful room with a sort of an ingle nook fireplace with mm -hmm. that surround that we mentioned was yes. copied for the new yes. downstairs, downstairs fireplace. Very, very nice room and would be a good master suite, but your sellers told me they needed to build a new one in part because there just there wasn't a great master bath, and now they've got one. And they have a beautiful master bath. Just it, it's so fresh and and it's light. Yes. It's got a great color scheme. Yes. It's really it's as you said fresh. I'd say crisp. Um, it's got that springtime feel. And it has a, a soaking tub that over, that where you can enjoy the view from the yard beyond. So it's lovely. Great. We've mentioned two bedrooms on that floor. There are three more. Yes. Um, and then we'd go upstairs to the the third floor which is that summer. summer yes that's summer nice big room a huge room uh, looks and what's interesting is it feels like the ballroom on an old mansion but it's brand new it's got the deep dormers um, lots of space it could be used as a family room mm -hmm. then we go around the corner there's another sitting room and two bedrooms two and those bedrooms. I think are in the original 
They are, and two additional baths that have been renovated. Really nice. Mm -hmm. Then finally, down to the basement, and that floor is, I think that's uh, summer? That is, the, that is winter. That's winter. Winter. That's our last season. And it, oh, the lower level opens out into a terraced garden that you can enjoy all year. Beautiful. They yeah. did a nice job there because they, knowing that it was going to be used as living space, they've got a, a movie room, they've got a kitchen and a right. family room. Right. They dug out the garden yes. so that it doesn't feel like a basement. It feels like a first floor. Yes. There's a nice big garden view there. That's right. Looking out into, we've talked about the four seasons in the house, but out, looking out into this yard, nearly an acre, where we can really enjoy all four seasons.